circumcision harm and the loss of sensitive skin or sensitive tissue, whatever you want to call it. it it's a little different than loss of sensitivity. Okay. So loss of sensitivity uh, is talked about a lot because the glands being uncovered all the time and rubbing against uh, clothing, etc. Um, the idea is that the, the glands become less sensitive because it keratinizes. But this video is talking about loss of sensitive skin. So according to the Sorrel study, most of the American circumcision documentary they talked about a lot there, um, this skin, this tissue, both the outer and the inner skin of the prepuce is the most sensitive to light touch. So all of that, which I've done another video, <coughs> oops, sorry, shows that you know, 15 square inches of tissue is no longer there. So now you're depending on the tissue down here to be your sensitive tissue. So that's gone. No getting it back. I mean, you can do you know, restoration and you know, try to pull that that skin up and and restore to get some glands coverage and maybe create more skin on your shaft. Um, but think of women that have gone through birth, they've got those stretch marks and everything like that. And it creates kind of like uh, scarred tissue and all that. Scarred tissue does not have the nerves that the tissue that you're born with has. Nerves don't grow like the rest of the cells do. Another harm.